What's up, everybody? I am back, and I got, I think it's Atilano's, or it's Atlano's. One of those two, but it's one of those local Mexican restaurants. I tried to see if it was elsewhere, just like looking it up on Google Maps, <laughs> but they didn't see it elsewhere besides one extra one in Idaho, but <clears throat> I love this. I got one of my favorites that I usually get every single time, but then I got two things that I don't normally get, and we're going to try them out today. And so I don't have to unbox too much. They gave me silverware. They gave me, I just asked for the hottest, and they gave me this more reddish looking one. And this one looks uh, scary. It's black. My hair is ridiculous today too. That looks a little bit better. But I'm actually super duper hungry. So let's see how much we can actually eat here. Okay, guys. Ugh. All right. So the torta, I think how you say it, is a sandwich and I got carne asada. It's kind of falling apart already. But ooh. Ooh, yeah, it's falling apart hardcore. Can't stay together worth anything. And then these are just topped with smooth. Topped with cheese, chicken, lettuce, tomato, guacamole, sour cream on top of tater tots. Holy shisa. But first things first, you guys. We gotta cut into this burrito real quick. They don't skimp on their burritos. Fantastic. And as we can see, half of it is almost a hand. So it's a good sized burrito. All of this today cost me, I tipped and it was only like a dollar tip. I was bad today, but it was $24 for everything, which I think is fantastic, right? Fantastic. I'm just going to move the paper now. It is useless. All right, everybody. I just made a quick cut because I saw the picture for the thumbnail and you guys don't have to see me dinking around with stupid faces. Let's, let's get to it, you guys. Let's get to it. I'm going to start with this death sauce. <laughs> Just right off the bat. What is that? It's so thick. Someday. is hot. <laughs> that is the hot salsa one. <laughs> Sounds a lot more green. I can't see the shot sometimes, so hopefully I got that. There is ham, bacon, potatoes, eggs, and cheese. It is the bomb.com. They're opening one up closer to mine. I was gonna go to that one because I thought it was open, but it's not open yet, I don't think. It still looked like a little crack house. <laughs> 
but that's okay, right? No, I'm just scared about starting my sandwich because the bottom literally already split in half. As you can see, it's falling apart hardcore. We're gonna go in on it. I'm actually gonna stand up to start this. <laughs> So carne asada is just like beef, you know, but they have like guacamole, they have the salsa mixed in with it, the veggies, it's so good. And even knowing the bread is kind of soggy and falling apart, it's still... Mm. my water over. Yeah. And I usually don't like tater tots. Usually. This is kind of like a casserole. And I'll get down to a casserole. The chicken is good. A little peppery. Scoot them away from me so there's not just constant styrofoam stretching. I'm so happy with this. I made the right choice. <sighs> it was either going to be Arby's or Amanos today. And I ran a little Instagram poll. Guys, Charles Addy Amanos. Mm. This is so good. I can eat a lot of it. Big boy portions. Oh, and there's beans. I'm feeling pretty healthy today. <laughs> so good. I'm going to try to finish this sandwich because a brick just hit my stomach. But see, very messy, sloppy. I don't know how the other sandwiches are though. But, <laughs> right.
I'm getting a couple bites. Boy, the bread is super dry. It needs. I don't want to really put salsa on it, but it needs more like guac or something. Made a pretty big dent in that, right? You gotta consider how deep it is. <clears throat> Just a bunch of scraps in there. Yeah, the white styrofoam is making the lighting bad for the food. Mm. Oh, it's because I spilled a salsa. When the F did that happen? Dumb. Alright everybody, I'm going to call it there. You know I'm done when I start burping and I don't want any big loud ones like the Pizza Hut video. I'm going to say sorry for that again. <laughs> feels like there's like an air bubble in my throat right now but <clears throat> anyone else is fantastic I've eaten there for a while now and I've tried you know I've always kind of stuck with the super breakfast burrito but I've tried other things before and some things of course are better than others but it always has been good I've never been let down and so I think this one might get like fast food scale, like at least a 9 out of 10. Like, it was like a 20 minute drive home. I waited as usual a little bit after I got home. And it still was warm, crispy, delicious. Ugh. I would definitely eat here again. <laughs> and so if you're ever visiting Spokane or I'm just wrong, and I didn't do my research <laughs> like, like I didn't um, <clears throat> then definitely try it it won't be let down everybody stay productive out there have a great rest of your day I hope you're doing well eat some good food take care of yourself do what you can <sighs> I'm doing what I can <laughs> we'll see us in the next video who knows what it's going to be I'm so sorry. There it was. <laughs> I'll just see us next time. Deuces.